feeling is reckless of knowing you're selfish and knowing I'm desperate, getting all in and love, falling all over love like. Hey guys, I already made breakfast. Um, I am now washing clothes. I'm mopping, and I'm about to set up this four drawer chest. Basically, it's just a little dresser. Dresser right here. I've been asking my husband to put that dresser up since we were in El Paso and he hasn't and then when we first excuse me when we first moved here I asked him if he could put the dresser up and um seven months later the dresser is still in the box so I guess I'm just gonna have to do it myself a girl I know here in Alaska gave me like a small tv so I'm just gonna go ahead and put that on top of there we usually don't like having tv in our room but I'm just gonna put it up because the tv is just kind of taking space in the garage and then after that, I'm going to finish washing my blankets, make my bed, and um, yeah, kind of just finish doing stuff around the house. And then a little later, I have to go to the commissary to get some food, because I, I have no clue what I'm gonna cook. But I kind of want a little bit of everything. I want chicken wings. Um, I want, I've been wanting homemade tacos so bad. So I just don't know what I'm gonna eat. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get started on building this dresser and then I will show you guys what it looks like. When it's like a little cheap one from Walmart, but yeah. I need somewhere to put some clothes in, so I'm like super unorganized and I just can't live like this anymore, so. It helped in Fort Bliss that we had a lot of um, storage and stuff like that built into the house, but here we don't have anything. So it kind of just sucks. But yeah, so let me get started. So I can't find my husband's screwdriver, so I have to use a stupid little tool for this whole thing because I don't want to use the drill on this cheap wood because it's going to end up, the screw's going to end up going through the whole freaking board. <laughs> so aggravated right now. God, this is going to take me forever having to use a stupid little thing.
the horrible, terrible thing that I just did. What an epic freaking fail. This is the drawer. What an epic fail. I'm supposed to put that in it. Like, ha. Huh? Like, I don't even want to unscrew these now. Like, really? Freaking really? Uh. <laughs> Depot, you know, little get up for right now because I'm, I'm planning to buy a, a whole bedroom set, but I'm trying to save money. So maybe after Christmas I'll do that. These kids are driving me crazy. But yeah, so I'm going to go get the kids dressed. I'm going to look up a recipe or something. I'm going to go to the store, buy stuff, and then I'm going to cook. Guys, look at this. You are so silly. Silly goose. I am laying down. Ew. Why am I licking my lips like that? <laughs> I am laying down. I am exhausted. Um, you guys already seen that I put the, the dresser up and I put the TV on top of it. And I had to go to this girl's house to get some stuff. Then I went to the commissary to get the stuff that I'm cooked tonight. Went to Starbucks, got everybody some hot chocolate. And I'm home. I was just talking to my husband for like an hour. He just boarded his flight. I hope he has a safe flight. But um, I really want to nap for like 30 minutes. So I'm probably going to put my alarm for 30 minutes and try to close my eyes. And then I'm going to get to cooking. And I have so much cleaning in the house to do. And I don't want to do anything. But you know when your husband's gone you take advantage of the time you have. So yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Well, I've been like super, super, super duper busy. So um, I did take a 15 minute nap. I know that sounds like nothing, but when you're a busy mama, that is life. I am now making the pasta and I'm making the sauce. I know it looks nasty because the cream cheese needs to melt up in there. But I am making chicken alfredo today. And I was going to record how I make it, but honestly, I just didn't have time to pull the tripod out. And, um, yeah, I just got to making it because it's getting late. I think it's, like, about to be six. And I'm just trying to get dinner done so then I can go ahead and take them a bath. And put some nice, clean PJs on them and start getting them into bed, at least. But yeah, um, my husband is on his like third flight, and um, yeah. <laughs> but I'll finish here and I'll show you what dinner looks like when it's done. So I just kind of want to show you guys my final step to make this. I know a lot of us get lazy and we buy the regular grated Parmesan already grated up. Yummy! I'm so excited and I can't wait to eat this. Okay. We're almost done.
I had turned off the heat because I didn't want my sauce to burn, but now I'm turning it back on just to melt the Parmesan. Guys, this is like one of my favorite dishes and I'm so excited. The first time I made this, it was so dry and just so weird tasting. But um, I tasted the sauce and it is so freaking good. I cannot believe it. So I'm excited. Oh, yummy. Doesn't this look great? I am so impressed with how this came out and the flavor that this pasta has. Give me a second, princess. I'm so impressed. So happy, so happy. The noodles are good? You sure? Mm -hmm. Mommy, you forgot? Yeah, well, taste it. You haven't even tasted it yet. Uh, Guys, this came out great, Oh, yeah. <laughs> for real? It's good for real? Good. I'm glad you like it. I'm going to try it now, guys. It's not soup, babe girl. It's pasta. My pasta. Yeah. Mm. It's bread. My husband will be impressed. Yeah. Really good. No, I don't have your bread. Natalia. Hmm? Ari, move your hand. Natalia. Yeah. Is it good? Mm -hmm. You're a mess. Let's eat it. Let's chocolate. No, I hate my chocolate. Oh my.